Nola, I was never angry with you, but I, I just feel that it was wrong for you to name your baby Kelly. I really wish you'd think things through more before you act impulsively and cause a lot of trouble. I'm trying, Derek. I really am. Oh, boy, time drags on here, you know. It really yeah. does, except when you come by to visit. Well, and actually, I have to be on my way, so if there's anything you need, just call me, all right? You know, Derek, thanks for being so nice to me, because I know I'm not Hillary's favorite person. Well, uh, Hillary and I are living together, but we're still individuals with individual tastes in things and in people. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, your real understanding about her relationship with Kelly. Yeah. Well, I'll uh, let you get back to that old movie you were watching when I came in. Oh, I don't mind missing the middle of it, besides the end of Casablanca is the best part anyway. Oh, I am sure. Oh, anyway, I'll be in touch. Bye, Derek. Okay. As far as I'm concerned, you better make up your mind soon and decide which one you're hung up on, Nola, Mr. McCord or Kelly. You're just saying these things to make me get on the plane. But don't ask me to leave, not like this. I'm not asking for myself. Inside us, we both know you're a part of Kelly, part of his work, the thing that keeps him going. I know it, you know it. He's got a mission, and it's bigger than anything we ever knew. It's not bigger than the love that we found here again in this little pocket of the world. Oh, I think so. You've always loved him. But what about us? I love you, too. And every time I hear Sam playing our song, something happens deep inside, something that doesn't happen with anybody else. I can't walk away from these feelings, not now. Look, I'm no good at being noble, but it doesn't take much to see that the problems of three little people don't amount to a hill of beans in this crazy world. But I said that I'd never leave you. I can go with you. I can't ask you to live my kind of life, Nola. On a moment's notice, I have to be free to go wherever my colleagues may want. Ask me. Don't you think I'd love to? But what's going to happen one day when you realize the mistake you've made? Not today, maybe, or tomorrow, but I'm one sorry. day soon. If we do not leave now, we will listen to this, the last prayer that for America. I do it patiently. Uh, just one moment, please. No, this is not just any patient. This is the President of the United States, and he will not be attended to by any other physician. The entire country is in my hands. I understand all that. It doesn't make it any easier. I have to be on that plane, Nola. With or without you, I have no choice. But I want you to know, if you should decide to stay, I'll understand. And I won't blame you. Get on that plane, Nola. It's the last one to America. And I'll always have this medical insignia. It's a remembrance of the time when you loved me. I'll always remember you, too. Every time I tell Sam to play it. Oh, I'm so confused. I don't know what to do. Go with Kelly. I must leave now. Goodbye. No, wait. I'm going with you. Dr. Nelson, do you mind if I... Kiss Nola one last time. Here's looking at you, kid. And tell Sam that he's still the best piano player in the world. Now. You still have time to change your mind? No. Besides, how can I let the President of the United States down? I promise you, you won't regret this.
Why can't real life be that beautiful? Well, frankly, I really...